I think anytime you go through a traumatic experience like that, it takes a toll on you mentally. It takes a little bit of a toll on you physically. A time of reflection for David Hart, owner of the Park Cafe and Coffee Bar in Bolton Hill. After almost two and a half years in business, he's decided to close the popular neighborhood hangout. Hart tells 11 News the thought of closing was planted in his mind back in January when his business was robbed at gunpoint a fifth time in three months. I think for me what it did is it sort of rejiggered my priorities. While police did make an arrest, the trauma remained for his employees and he had to make some changes. We lost staff and we had to replace staff, but that was surmountable. We then made a decision to go um, cashless and that took somewhat of a toll, but again, not enough to disrupt the business. Hart says what helped keep him in the game was the community, which continued to support the business. But in the end, it's more important to spend time with his family and not have to deal with the headaches that come with owning a restaurant. I'm proud of the city. I'm proud of what the police did. They caught this person. I'm proud of the community that came together and could have thrown up their hands and said, oh, we're not going to go to the Park Cafe. It's a dangerous place to be. But it was none of those things, and, and people really pulled together. And now there is a silver lining here. Hart tells us that the cafe is financially sound and he says within the past couple of weeks or so he's received about a half dozen offers to buy the place. So he's fairly confident that it should reopen most likely under a new name in the next month or so. We're live in Bolton Hill tonight. I'm Lowell Melser, WBAL TV 11 News.